It's October, and you know what that means. The very first All Elite Crate by Pro Wrestling Tees. Let's do it. Guys and gals, what's cracking? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Jim, and this is another Junk in the Box video. And as you saw from the intro, this is something I have been waiting for since it was first announced. So, Pro Wrestling Tees, based out of Chicago, and the people behind the infamous Pro Wrestling Crate monthly subscription box announced at the end of June that they were launching the very first All Elite Crate with items in this box only exclusive to AEW. The number one wrestling promotion in existence right now. My favorite promotion, AEW number one. So, pre-orders for this box, or this crate, went out in July, the beginning of July, and with shipping, uh, I paid about $52 for this. And here's the thing, it sold out quick. Um, I was worried I was not going to be able to get a hold of this because I didn't have the money at the time. I had to wait until I got paid. So, that payday, I actually got up at about 2 or 2.30 in the morning when my paycheck hit the bank, got online, and I got me a crate. And that very same day, I want to say around 11 or noonish, the crate was gone. Sold out. Sold out that quick. So, um, this is a quarterly crate, so the next box will actually come out in January. So, also what they're doing with this, is, it's, it's kind of cool, is that the uh, crates are themed. They're themed based on their pay-per-views. So, being since Full Gear is coming up in November up in Minnesota, this box is the Full Gear crate. So... I'm not quite sure what to expect, and I'm not quite sure what's going to be in the uh, in these crates. But I do know this: I do know that uh, there is an autograph 8x10 of an AEW superstar. There is a monthly pin, or not a monthly pin, um, a quarterly pin. There is going to be a micro brawler, an AEW micro brawler. Uh, also, there's going to be two T-shirts exclusive AEW t-shirts in this crate and there's also going to be um, they, they said four other uh, items, uh, collector's items from AEW so it's going to be a surprise as what those items are I don't really have any idea what, it could, what they're going to be, we'll have to wait and see and then uh, you also get I believe your usual uh, you also get a discount from shopaew.com and also you get an entry and a chance to win two front row seats to a future Dynamite show. So that's kind of cool. Um, so let's get to the box. The first ever AEW All Elite Crate. I'm excited. I want to know what's in here. You guys all know I love my wrestling, especially AEW. So let's open this up and find out what kind of AEW goodness we are blessed in the inaugural edition of the All Elite Crate. So, I apologize for the lighting. It looks kind of funky in here because my wife's got all kinds of fancy dancy lightings in here. Uh, she's got a purple light over here uh, for her plants and then over to my left over here where I just looked is her Himalayan salt lamp. So, it's got a little funky vibe to it here uh, for the background for this video. So. Let's go ahead and open up the crate and see what we got. Uh, this is, okay, we don't want to see this yet. This is the full gear, like I said, this is the All Elite Crate Full Gear 2021 crate. Uh, the other side of this card contains the spoilers for this crate. We don't want to see it. And then here is the advertisement. AEW Full Gear, Saturday, November 13th, on pay-per-view from, I believe, the Target Center in Minneapolis, Minnesota. It was supposed to be from 
St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, but conflicts with the UFC changed that. So they're going to be in Minnesota. Okay, let's... Uh, do we want to do a t-shirt first? Yeah, let's do one of the t-shirts first. We'll do a t-shirt first. I'm not sure. I don't remember who's in the first crate, to be honest with you. So it's going to be a surprise. First t-shirt is a navy blue t-shirt. And we have... Let's see, we, we have... Kenny Omega. We got a Kenny Omega t-shirt. So pretty cool. The current AEW world champion, Kenny Omega of the Elite. And it's actually my very first Kenny Omega item of any kind. So I'm happy with that. Uh, we'll set this shirt off to this. I don't want to see this shirt yet. This shirt's going to be last. Uh, let's see what this is. We have the pin. Bam! There's the pin. And that is a bloodied face of Dr. Britt Baker, DMD. So this is a pretty, pretty slick looking pin. So the bloody face, I believe this is uh, from her, it was during the pandemic when there weren't a whole lot of fans allowed in the arenas, but she had a lights out unsanctioned match with Thunder Rosa. Probably one of the greatest women's matches I've ever seen. What these two ladies did to each other was absolutely off the charts. So that is what that's from. Dr. Britt Baker, DMD pin. Uh, that's the micro brawler. Uh, not, I don't want to do that yet. Uh, let's see. What is this? We have... Oh, no, this is the this is the micro this is the micro brawler. So we have a sting. The icon sting micro brawler. I like that. That is very slick. AEW Sting Micro Brawler. And he actually does V shouts through Zobi. So I most likely will send this in for a V shout and have Sting sign this micro brawler for me. I like that. I like it. So this is this was not a micro roller that I thought it was because I could feel the plastic on this thing. So let's see what we got. <laughs> okay, that's kind of cool. It's a Darby Allen finger skateboard. You know the ones where you go <laughs> Darby Allen finger skateboard with extra wheels. So all right, that's kind of cool and snazzy. Uh, yep, I'll, just, I'll figure out a way to display this somehow. But that's pretty cool. I like that. Uh, let's see what we got here. We got a poster. Oh, this is kind of cool. Okay, we have a poster. And I can always, and I can already tell you, it is a lights out unsanctioned match. This was from, I believe this was, this was from, I believe, oh, this was Full Gear, that's right, it's Full Gear Crate. Full Gear 2019, this was, from Baltimore, Maryland, when Kenny Omega did battle with John Moxley. So, this is actually another pretty cool thing that I could send in to get signed, because I know John Moxley also does Zobi V Shouts, so I could get him to sign this, and maybe one day get Kenny Omega to sign this and frame it somehow and display it so okay that's pretty cool i like that too uh the next one let's do this we have ha uh this is this is pretty cool we have a beer bottle opener and hangman adam page hangman adam page beer bottle opener that is pretty cool I like that. The, the next t-shirt is black. And we have... Is that... No. This is the... Oh, yeah. The inner circle. We got Jericho. We got... Looks like we got Jericho, uh, Hager on here, and Santana Ortiz and Guevara in little skeleton masks. So I like that. 
the inner circle, the inner, eh, can't even talk, inner circle t-shirt. I like that. I was actually hoping to get that someday. Um, it's in my shopping cart and shopaew.com. Uh, what is this here? This is an all elite crate sticker. Pretty cool. And then here is the autograph 8x10. The very first AEW autograph in the AEW crate. So let's see who it is. Um, out of all my wrestling, out of my wrestling autograph collection, my 8x10s, the, uh, my AEW collection is actually is actually growing. Um, it's probably the biggest of all my collections. AEW. I, I have the most AEW stuff. So, and here is the autograph eight by ten, and it's Sheeta. Okay, that's a pretty cool autograph. My first one of Sheeta. pretty cool pretty cool all right guys that's it nothing left in the box so let's go over what we got in the crate so we've got the hangman we got the hangman adam page beer bottle opener we've got the dragon kenny omega t-shirt the skulls inner circle t-shirt sting micro brawler uh yep like i said the bottle opener from adam page the Moxley vs. Omega 2019 poster from Full Gear. The Hikaru Shida autograph 8x10. The Britt Baker hardcore pin. The Darby Allen skateboard. Uh, Dark Circle, Dark Order Circle patch. That's not in here. One item short, guys. The very first All Elite crate. And I am missing an item. Let me take a look at the t-shirts here. So, yep, there is no Dark Order circle patch in this crate. So I did not receive that. But that's okay. Not a big deal because I love Pro Wrestling Tees and I love Pro Wrestling Crate. And now I love AEW Crate. So, eh, not a big deal. So, and then the All Elite Crate logo sticker. So, guys, this was a pretty cool box. Uh, yeah. Two thumbs up to Pro Wrestling Tees on the very first AEW All Elite Crate. Um, I liked it. I'm very happy with it. My favorite items in this box... I always love autographs, but obviously I'm, I like it all. I mean, the shirts are great, especially the Inner Circle shirt. I love the Stig Micro Brawler and the poster. So, um, guys, let me know what you thought of the AW Crate. If you got one yourself, let me know how, what you liked and what you didn't like. You know, I like talking to you. Shoot me some comments. Um, like I said, the next crate comes out in January. And pay-per-view wise, I think Revolution is around February. So the next crate might be related to Revolution. Um, don't quote me on that, but I have a good hunch that it is Revolution. Um, if you like the video, smash that thumbs up button. Help me out. Also, ring that bell if you haven't done so already. That way you'll be notified when I upload new content and subscribe we're almost to 100 let's subscribe so we can get that giveaway underway guys thanks for watching i truly appreciate it and uh we'll see you on the next video take care of each other and have fun collecting